have some running around to do. And I guess I'm gonna take you guys with me. Um, last minute things that I need for vacation. So anyway, so last minute things I need for vacation. I have a list of things. You know you feel like, okay, I made a list, but I still am not sure if I remember everything. Well, that's where I am right now. Oh, I'm just sitting here. I'm parked because Dee's getting his hair cut. Um, I'm waiting outside. Yay. Um, so here we are again. Me talking to you while I wait for Dee. I have a gift card that I got for Christmas. But I forgot to spend. I forgot I even had it. It's sad. That's how bad my memory is getting. I don't even remember when I have free money on the table. It's perfect because I was going to shop at this store anyway. It's Victoria's Secret. And I need to get... I want... Well, need... I wanted to get some new bras. Um, so, I'm getting some new bras for vacation. So, I'll probably get some panties too. But So, I have to go there. I have to go to Walmart and get a whole bunch of like travel-y type things. D has to get something too. And I forgot what he has to get. But he remembers. But I know that we're going to get it from Walmart. Oh, I don't mind a stretch. I hate when I do a pour in and there's like little bits that didn't mix in at the bottom. That's where I'm at right now. Fun fact, full disclosure, I found two gift cards that I um, forgot about. Um, I'm just in a, a very overwhelming time in my life. And even just right now in this time of the day, um, in time of the week, I'm feeling very anxious about vacation. Um, my anxiety, uh, it's like, uh, it's very frustrating. I feel like I have butterflies. It's like, not nervous, but like this really inexplainable feeling of dread about the vacation. It's like how you feel if you are going into a situation where you think something. Um, if you're going into a situation where you think something's gonna go wrong, or when you're maybe scared or worried about something. I've been having that feeling a lot. I've been trying to take like deep breaths and like, cause it really is like, you know, like, I feel my heart racing. I feel like I have butterflies. Like, I feel like a nervousness. But I don't have those feelings about the vacation. Like, if I think about, like, am I worried about vacation? I'm not worried about vacation. I'm not worried that something's going to happen. But this is how I feel when I have things to do. Even when I know it's fun things. Like, something I'm going to enjoy. I cannot wait to go on vacation. Like, I can't wait... I can't wait to just be able to relax and not deal with day-to-day -day stresses and not really have to think about any responsibilities. Just have fun. So I really need this vacation and I can't wait to go. And I feel like it's going to be so much fun at all the things I get to do. But I'm dreading it. It's the most confusing part to me about my particular um, struggle with anxiety um, and depression is that like this is when good things are about to happen and I even if I like in the back of my mind know nothing bad's gonna happen everything's gonna be great and I actually cannot wait to go on this trip and I know it's gonna be fun I still have this dread and this dread will get me to the point where I feel like if this trip got canceled I wouldn't even care That's a weird feeling to have. Sorry, I'm taking my vitamins. I'm trying to make sure I stay up on my vitamins um, because physically I feel better when I do. Um, so I just need to really just stay on point with it. It's kind of hard sometimes um, because I do work overnight and I treat that as my day and so I take my vitamins along the course of that day which is night and then when I'm off 
then I try to get on like a normal schedule and it probably throws me my body off but anyway I'm deficient in um different things so I take a multivitamin which like most people should take a multivitamin I mean it's you know there's that's just you know all the different nutrients if you're not getting it from your uh food every single day multivitamin um so I take a multi I take B complex um which is a lot of different B vitamins rolled all into one pill um I also take um, calcium with vitamin D. Um, I probably should roll my windows up because every time a car goes by, I feel like I gotta be quiet because I don't know if it's drowning out my voice. Um, so sorry if it is. Um, uh, so I have to take calcium and I take the calcium with vitamin D because I'm deficient in vitamin D as well. Um, years of I believe it's years of being on nights I've been on a night shift for many years 10 years specifically 10 plus years specifically at this current job and before that I worked at night too um so I don't get much natural vitamin D um and honestly now I'm a little sensitive to it so what a mess. <laughs> oh, so I also take Plexus um, supplement. Also, I take um, an iron pill. It's called Vitron C because it has iron with vitamin C because when you need to take iron, I'm deficient in iron as well. Um, I'm a touch anemic, maybe more than a touch actually. Whenever you take an iron supplement, you're supposed to take vitamin C with it to help it absorb in your body better um, instead of just taking iron on its own. So um, when I first got, um, when my doctor first put me on this years ago, um, well, maybe about, about five years ago, um, I was taking vitamin C too. Like I was taking two different pills. <clears throat> I was taking the iron pill and the vitamin C and then um, my doctor recommended Vitron C and now that's the only way I do it because that just at least cuts out one other pill I have to take. I do the same thing with vitamin D. Uh, there's vitamin D in my multivitamin and there's vitamin D in my calcium. So there's that. Um, I know I'm doing a lot of talking about vitamins. I think it's kind of distracting me from my um, thoughts about uh, um, my anxiousness on this trip. I just want to get there. So then like my the anxiety the anxiety from the build up of going on vacation will subside once I'm there so I just want to get there and I'm so I'm just like pushing through um but anyway enough about vitamin talk um so we have uh, some stores in the mall I need to go to at some point I'm probably going to have to drop Devin off and then go on continue on because he's definitely going to get annoyed by me wanting to go to a whole bunch of stores that um, don't concern him. Especially when I go into Victoria's Secret. I'm not going to put him through that. Um, <laughs> unless I just maybe split up with him and let him go to another store while I'm in there. Oh, I might do that. So he can look at some other things and then I don't have to like take a trip home. Although it wouldn't necessarily be too far out of the way. I don't like I'm currently like five minutes away from home. But we have to go to some other stores. Whatever. Blah, blah, blah. I'm talking a lot. Anyway, we're just waiting for him to get done getting his hair cut. I probably need to like move my car, but there was nowhere else to park. I don't know if he'll know that I'm here. Anyways, so if you guys follow me on Instagram, you probably already know. But I'm going to Vegas. It's my first time going to Vegas. So I am excited about that because, I mean, at my big age, I've never been to Vegas before, so fun. Um, yeah, fun times. And so I have never vlogged a um, vacation before. So we'll see how that goes. Um, I'm going to try to vlog as much as I can for you guys. My, my flight is about four hours. It's nonstop. Thank God. Thank you, Lord. We have an evening flight. That's a love shot too. Just worked out that way. Love that for me. Um, young B's back.
Forever 21 was weird. In the store, Forever 21 has small, medium, and large. Not even extra large. They don't have plus sizes, but they have little girl sizes. And men. They had a men's section. The no plus size section. And this was a big Forever 21. It's the biggest store. Aside from the department stores like Macy's and JCPenney. The biggest one in the mall. Easily. It took up at least two or three storefronts. That's like kind of disappointing. Um, I usually have like gone online to Forever 21, ugh, Forever 21 and found really cute stuff for plus sizes. Nothing in store. Not even an extra large. I just thought it was weird to have a whole store. Okay, like it's one thing if you have small, medium, large. That's the stance you're taking on your store. But online you have the plus sizes. And you had kid sizes and uh, men sizes. So you had a whole section for girls, whole section for men, no plus sizes. It's also weird too because they had like posters and advertisements with uh, plus size women in there. Anyway. Sorry, I had to run back to the car because I forgot my gift card. Hold. I went all the way in the mall for Victoria's Secret because I found this gift card and I left the gift card in the car by accident. Anyway, let's go back in the mall. Go to Victoria's Secret. Bra shopping.
spent too much at Walmart. Check. <laughs> Cap. Oh, wait. Where is the cap? It's on the seat. Why'd you lay one in there? Uh, it's not doing anything major. But uh, let me try to shake it. By the way, this is Coca Cola Tic Tac. Now, uh, shaking it is going to do something without that. So, why are you doing that? Don't open that up. <laughs> Even if there wasn't anything in it, shaking it is going to be a problem. What is wrong with you? Johnson. Devin. <laughs> these inside of Pepsi. Like, Sound like a good idea in my head. I mean, we'll just see what it makes it taste like, I guess. No, stop shaking it. I'm trying to like, dissolve you can't, it. But it's, you can't open it for a while now. <laughs> You've shaken it too much. I want to try these like alone. Yeah, I should take a Coca Cola. Okay. Look at that. <laughs> How do they do that? It really does taste like Coca Cola. Hmm. Take that might be as good as um, Pop Tarts. I'm here for that. Oh, that's a little too much. So, this is the end of this part of my vlog this was a long vlog over several days and um so i'm breaking up this was just my pre-vacation prep shopping and all the things and then in the next vlog you'll see vacation thank you so much for watching this all the way to the end you have a real mvp and please like share subscribe i'd love it if you'd subscribe um and i'll see you in the next video bye